Welcome back to Go Southern Alberta. Well, Liz just gave us all the details on the historic Lethbridge Festival. And now we're joined by Bianca at the University of Lethbridge. The 60s are alive and well here. We can see by your fabulous outfit here. We're standing in a 60s exhibit right now, though. Tell us a little bit about what's going on here. Yeah, this is a 1960 exhibition. And uh, the main idea was to represent the counterculture, so the hippies that were evolving to that time and um, everything they stood for, so against um, rebelling against the 50s and 40s and using more untraditional art to represent themselves so. okay, so and as well as fashion of course right. of course of course so for someone who didn't grow up in the 60s I'm assuming <laughs> how did what kind of research went into this where did you get your information how did you pick out the pieces that are here um, a lot of the information I uh, got through watching documentaries okay. so my dad he actually went to the university here oh, wow. and um, he was really active during the 60s so he really okay. helped me to yeah, no go through this and um, I watched uh, the Woodstock festivals okay. of course and yeah. Beatles and everything so it was really interesting yeah. and yeah a lot of fun research right yeah, yeah that was really fun okay so tell us about this one picture that we have behind us because this is sort of what you formed the entire yeah. exhibit around right this is a, a print by Ron Katai mm -hmm. and I really I found this piece and it really um, moved me and that, then I knew I wanted to create like um, a more cultural theme about like the young people and the hippies so I just built my whole exhibition around this piece because I really wanted to use it. Yeah. Okay, perfect. And now anybody's welcome, public, university students, everybody's welcome to come down and check this out, right? Yeah, that's right. Perfect. Now, if you do want more information on this, you can always visit the university's website. Thank you so much for filling us in today, Bianca. Uh -huh.